I got these nice LED uh, arrays uh, in a recent I showed them in a recent post bag and I was um, I wanted to light it up and see what it actually looks like because I've got no data on these at all I don't really know how to wire them up so I thought I might experiment with them and you can uh, see what my process is for you know reverse engineering one of these things so I've got a breadboard here it's got one of these little power supplies so you've got 12 volts in here and then you, you this plugs into the breadboard and provides 5 volts or 3 volts and um, I put a couple of jumper wires on here and a 2k resistor to limit the current because I don't want to blow any of these things up and we'll just plug this into the part of the breadboard and we'll see if we can make this work Yeah, so I've got five volts there and a bit of current limiting, so that should be safe to test the LEDs. And so quite often on these chips, one of the one or other of the top corners might be a common anode or cathode. So let's plug in here and see what happens. Ah, okay. So I lit something up there. That's not that's not the top actually. So that's lit up green. Okay, so there's the top, which is blue. So I think they could be actually linear. So uh, that's this is the positive side, the green. That's the negative side. So perhaps it's an all anodes down this side and all cathodes. So we'll just step down. Yeah. All green. Ah, oh, orange. Orange, red. And red at the bottom. Okay. That's pretty nice actually. So I'm not quite sure what I'm going to do with this. I mean the obvious thing is to make some kind of battery tester. Um, but it's just a, it's a nice thing. And uh, right now, blue. I mean, perhaps the thing to do is connect it to an Arduino and just make it flash some nice patterns. So perhaps I'll do that. So here's what I've come up with. I've got a, an Arduino Uno here, or a clone anyway. I've got some of the digital inputs connected up to each of the 10 anodes. Let me switch the light down so you can see it more easily. So it's alternating between a bar mode there and a dot mode scanning up and down. So there's the bar, there's the dot. And if you want to do the same I'll upload my Arduino sketch and uh, put it on my GitHub site and I'll put the link down below. Um, so I hope you like the look of these LED displays. I really like them. And um, thanks for watching this latest video.